Hello and welcome everybody. Today we are in Amsterdam, in B Amsterdam. And today we are here with Nick, Bart, Matthijs and Diego Mires. And we're going to train right now. Bye bye! bye, -bye. say one. When the ball bounces, you have to say two. Okay. And when you have to hit, you have to say three. So you have to follow the rhythm. One, two, three. Sometimes you are doing this. They hit the bandeja and you do one. The ball bounces, you do two. And put it three. It's too early. The idea is, play a bandeja to me. Look, when they hit, I would say one. Play a bandeja to me. So, two, one, two, three. Again, bandeja. And this is something that you have to use when you return in the matches. So when the player is serving, is making the ball bounce, you wait. When he serves, you have to say one. When the ball bounce is in your box, you have to say two. And when you hit, you have to say three. So I wait for the service. One, two, three. And I get sure that the ball is in. Sometimes you don't control the rhythm, and this is a one mistake. One, two, three. Okay, so try to play with the rhythm. The faster you play, the faster is the one, two, three. Yeah. It's not always one, two, three. Serve a bit faster, please. One, two, three. And then put the volume. Finish on your left pocket. 
I don't break it. Okay. Tension. So do the preparation again. Prepare again. Nice. Go forward. Push, push. Go. Okay. Wait. Relax. Continue. Yeah. This one. Okay. This one. You see? Yeah. You feel tension? Okay. On the wrist? You feel it? No. Or where do you feel more tension? Here or there? Uh, Here, I think. Yeah. yeah. So when you finish, there. Do the preparation. One second, push forward, push, 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 continue pushing. Push, push, you will win. You feel? Yeah. Don't do this. Yeah. The same like the one. Yeah. So yes, don't the same. Try. Yeah. Prepare. Have to stop. Here. We're going to do one side. Push. And this feeling. Not this way. So don't break it so much. Yeah. Keep it tight. Hold here. So I will show you guys when I hit the ball. Don't look at the ball, look my wrist. When I finish, I feel tight here. I don't break it. Okay? Yeah. More tight. Much higher? Head? Head? Like here or there? Depends. Many people do that because they make the lever on the line. Yeah. So they don't have time to let the ball be lower. So that is why, for example, if you see Sebastian Nerone, yeah. he plays the lever very, very high. Yeah. But he's jumping behind the line. Yeah. So the idea is that if you have time, if you have time, prepare lower and let the ball be lower. Yeah. If you want to keep the net with a lever, Prepare higher yeah. and make it there. 
Yeah, so, so the further the further you are from the net, the higher you should hit exactly. and the higher you should because prepare. Which is the objective with the overhead shots? To keep, keep the, the net. net. Yeah. So if you make it very low, yeah. you will waste a lot of time and position. Yeah. So the idea is that the more you are at the back, yeah. the higher you have to keep it yeah. to keep the net. If you don't feel confident, then bounce. Yeah. It's not obligatory. Yeah. But if you feel confident with your shots yeah. from the line, there yeah. and go to the net. Yeah. Middle of the court, here, acceleration. Yeah. Depends on your body position yeah. and, of course, your technique. And your height as well. And your technique. I feel much more confident than in the ball bounce. Because I feel more confident with the like, off the ball shots. Yeah, and, and if you're taller, you can talk a little bit more. Of course. Yeah. Yeah. That yes. So from here. Okay. Tuck, tuck, tuck. With control. Yeah. If the ball is going to bounce a bit deeper, two steps, tuck. That you don't finish. That is why the volley goes. Defend now. So far two. Defend now. Chicken ass. Yeah. Tuck, tuck, tuck. I'm probably. Yeah. What kind of ass? So, yeah, the, the chicken, chicken ass. ass. Chicken ass. <laughs> comes to you the two but if he makes the half volley yeah. and then the ball comes here you have to be ready yeah and that's to meet the ball okay if the half volley the ball goes like this yeah go high when you hit the ball you have to stay one second extra down look this and this yeah. so when you hit keep it and then recover yeah hit it and then recover don't hit go down okay but yeah. volley the ball he has to be active and you yeah. all the time up okay? yeah. we switch very good eh? thank you so, guys if the ball comes to your body do you have to use forehead or back hand okay good back Yes, yeah. 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 Y
So one with bounce and one body. I don't know who goes, but you have to be very active. But come on. Nice. One. Two. Yes. Good. Nice. Yes. One step back, and from that position you can manage. Yeah. But if you stay at the net, they will go back, boom. Yeah. So keep a distance. The more they go to the net, the more you have to go backwards. Okay? So if you put the chicken at the spin, the body to the middle. Don't go to spin to my legs. So don't go to my legs to, to first. Yeah. Try to pass through the middle. Okay? Don't play like a chicken without head. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. Chicken head or chicken S? Chicken S like this. And you think like you don't care, it's to play one there and one there. Okay? You have to go to the last day, come on. Back. 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 The second side glass, you are going to open. Okay? Only that. Then, if you do it correctly, we we'll continue with this one. But this one, instead of opening, you will turn. You will turn. Sorry. We're very fast. Understand that? Yeah. Yes, so follow the ball more. Yes, so you have to follow closer and then rotate and follow the ball. Okay? okay. Nice, nice. So a little faster when you make 28 shots. Back, 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 back. Turn, turn. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. <laughs> that, 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 that. Two, back, a little faster, eh? Back, three, back. Four, back. cake the two the bride and the and the man yeah you look like that when you talk you look like this 
Okay? What you have to do is to follow the ball like this. Go back and come back. This is the rotation. Follow. There. And over. You are doing this. says that the same player cannot hit twice okay so what you have to do all the time is volleys to the middle okay but the ball has to bounce over the yellow row yeah. and you have to use the glasses if it is necessary but the return always to the middle you cannot hit twice if the ball is there you have to go Your body, in your case, you hit the ball too much at the front. Yep. Where do you think that the ball will go? Where do you too think? short. Where? Look the ref. Uh, too much to my So I don't want that. Yeah. If I hit at the waistline, where do you think that the ball will go? To the middle. Perfect. And behind? Uh, across. The same for you. Where do you think that yeah, the ball will go? I guess it will go there. Yeah. Just then. If I want to play to the middle, you have to hit the ball at the waistline. Here. You will see now. No straight. If I if he plays a ball to the mesh, who goes? They always let me. Always him. <laughs> what we have to do is to anticipate the line of the ball. If the ball is going to him, the ball passes first through your side. So you have to cut the ball from here. You have to see the ball and intercept 
because he needs some help. Yeah. If he says, yeah, okay, we know that already. If, if he says, <laughs> if he says, okay, I will go with the figura here. Okay, I have to go here. Yeah. Okay, I have to go there. In the end, yeah. in three games, he's at the hospital. Yeah. No. So when I play the figura and the ball comes to the middle because I am at the back, I need you to intercept, to follow the line of the ball. He goes. So when the ball goes to the middle, it sounds better, but you need, you, know. <laughs> you need, you need that I do this. Intercept so you can help me behind. You understand what I mean? So you never play on the line, play always. Yeah. When the ball is there, this player much closer to the net, so the one at the back. Uh, I normally say as a coach, I'll both at the first post, but what do you say? If you make the ball into the middle and the ball bounces before the line, it will be difficult for you. Yeah. So get closer. Okay. If you make a ball very deep, that is the opponent will use the glass a little bit behind. Oh, okay. Because with the glass, he can play lobs, he can play low, he can play aggressive. Yeah. Without the glass, if the ball is quite nice, he cannot play lobs. No. He cannot attack. He will defend. Yeah. So if we make balls with the slice to the middle without the glass, Closer. If the ball has a lot of bounce, I need more behind. Yeah. Okay? So now we're going to play a little bit, some games, and I will be coaching you two games. And then I coach you two games. Will you hit me? I think I need some extra help. They need more help? <laughs> okay, so check out. We pick up the <laughs> for watching i hope you liked this video if you want to see more videos with diego mires then like the video and subscribe to the channel thank you everybody for the training and i'll see you, you next time Hasta luego. ciao Bye. Adios. Bye. 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 Bye.